most sophisticated and luxurious interior together with a dynamic driving experience. Introducing the all-new 2015 Jaguar XJ in Ultimate Black. The XJ is a sporting luxury sedan that comes with a 3.0 liter V6 supercharged engine that pushes out 340 horsepower. In addition, the XJ body is made extensively of lightweight aluminum. This together with the V6 engine enables the XJ to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 5.7 seconds. So unlike many other brands and models, the Jaguar XJ comes standard with many cool technologies. Some examples are the Smart Keyless Access Entry, Blind Spot Monitoring System, Soft Closing Door, Panoramic Glass Roof, Power Trunk, and the 8-inch Color Touchscreen Display with Navigation System. Now the model we're looking at here is the basic XJ model that comes as a rear-wheel drive. Of course, you can upgrade it to the all-wheel drive model or the XJ Supercharged version with 470 horsepower or the most powerful XJ R model with 550 horsepower. Of course, as you move up the scale, the price tag will also increase. Here's a key fob to the car. On there, we have the lock, unlock, trunk release, panic button in red, and the light control button. Let's go ahead and unlock it and take a closer look at the interior. Now, as I just mentioned earlier, the XJ does come pre-equipped with a smart keyless access entry. So all you really have to do is leave the key fob in your pocket or purse. To unlock the door, simply put your hand behind the handle. And as you unlock the door, the side view mirror will automatically unfold. And to lock, simply touch a button on the outer side. Here's a quick view of the interior. Interior come in jet leather and burl walnut wood trim. Looks very nice. Quick view of the back seat. And to start the engine, all I have to do is push your foot down on the brake and press the start button right here. Now to open the engine hood, there's going to be a lever down here. All we have to do is pull this lever out, and this will initially open the hood. And to open the hood fully, there's going to be another lever located right on top of the Jaguar logo. All I have to do is lift that up and raise the hood. Under the hood, the 2015 Jaguar XJ has a 3.0 liter V6 supercharged engine. The V6 engine is able to push out 340 horsepower and 332 pound-foot of torque. It is a 8-speed automatic transmission with shift paddles mounted behind the steering wheel. The 2015 Jaguar XJ can get from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 5.7 seconds, and its top speed is electronically limited to 121 miles per hour. Keep in mind this is a rear-wheel drive vehicle. As for fuel economy, the XJ gets 18 miles per gallon in the city, 27 miles per gallon on the highway, and when combined it gets 21 miles per gallon. The gas mileage will vary depending on which driving mode you're in, relax, sport, or winter. To further enhance gas mileage, you can also enable the intelligent stop and start feature which will automatically shut off the engine when you come to a complete stop such as red lights or traffic jams and it will instantly restart as soon as you lift your foot off the brake. What's good about this feature is that you can turn it on or off at any time you like. Up front, there's the power intermittent windshield wiper. Moving down, we have the chrome mesh grille with the iconic Jaguar badge in the center. The front bumper is equipped with parking sensors that will automatically notify the driver when the vehicle gets close to hitting any objects. For enhanced visibility, there's the intelligent front lighting system that consists of the stylish bifunction HID Xenon headlights with power washer feature along with the integral LED signature daytime running lights. You can also add the optional adaptive front lighting system. With this, the headlight will follow the driver's steering wheel input and shine the beam in the direction of the wheels. There's also the intelligent high beam that will automatically switch to low beam as cars approach and will switch back to high beam after they pass. Moving over to the side, there's the Jaguar side fender, body color side view mirror with integrated LED turn signal light, power adjustable feature, and power folding feature. And lastly, there's also the built-in blind spot monitoring system on both side view mirror that uses radar technology to alert your driver if there's a car in the blind spot while changing lanes. 
The standard XJ model comes with 19-inch 10-spokes Aleutian alloy wheels. Behind the wheels, we have the advanced jack wall braking system that includes emergency brake assist, electronic brake force distribution, dynamic stability control, and cornering brake control. All four wheels are equipped with the tire pressure monitoring system. To the back, there's the middle LED brake light located behind the rear windshield. Moving down, there's the Jaguar logo in the middle and on both sides are the eye-catching LED tail lamps with LED brake light and LED turn signal light. The rear is also equipped with a rear view camera that automatically turns on when the car is put into reverse. Parking assists are also built into the rear bumper that automatically notifies the driver when the vehicle gets close to hitting any objects. At the bottom, there's the gorgeously attractive rear diffuser that hugs the dual chrome exhaust tip. And lastly, to specifically distinguish this from other model, there's the XJ badge located on the left hand side. As for the gas tank, just make sure the car is unlocked. To open, simply push in. And to lock, simply push back. Here's a full view of the roof. And i also show you what the panoramic roof looked like with the tilt function on and what it looked like fully open. Here it is with the tilt function on. As you can see it slightly raises up which looks very cool and sporty. And here it is with it fully open. As it extends to the back, it lifts upward, which makes it look very attractive. I'll go ahead and we'll take a full walk around and show you what it looks like. And here's a close up view. Now let's take a closer look at what's inside the trunk. On the lower bottom here, there's your rear view camera. And to open the trunk, simply press this button on the right hand side. The trunk looks very spacious. Inside, as you see all the way to the back, there's two hooks for you to securely hook down anything you need to. And this looks like the spare tool for your tires. fuse box and if we lift this up the spare tire along with the battery rests nicely under here and on top if you ever get yourself locked in the trunk you can simply pull this down to release yourself very nice safety feature and here's the power trunk lock button And we're back on the inside. Steering wheel is all leather with chrome accent trim throughout. Looks and feels very nice. On the left hand side, we have the different audio modes control with volume up, down, and channel control. Down here, we have the Bluetooth wireless phone answering option, voice command. And back here is the heated steering wheel control. Jaguar logo in the middle with the horn. On the left side, we have the different control in which you can use to control everything that's going to be displayed on the odometer. From vehicle setting, trip computer, to language, and many other display controls. Down below, we have the cruise control. And behind the steering wheel, we have the standard shift paddle, one on the right and another on the left. Here's the windshield wiper control. Press up to increase and down to decrease. Intensity control in the middle. And simply pull this towards us to activate one-time wiping and press the button on the end to release the windshield washer. Over here we have the right and left turn signal. Simply push down for left, up for right, 
and to control the headlamps simply twist this in the middle you can leave it on on off or auto and we can simply pull this towards us to activate the temporary high beam and push it away to turn the high beam on permanently and the button on the end is used to control the trip odometer Here we have the steering wheel column control. You can move this up, down, away from you, or towards you. Driver air vent. And down here we have the trunk release button, fog light control, and odometer dimmer. Driver sun visor with a small credit cord holder. Also have a small built-in piece of mirror with light which turn on and off according to the open and closure of the mirror. You can also move this over to the side for better sun coverage. Two additional air vent with an analog clock in the middle. And here's the full touchscreen audio display. Setup screen here. Navigation view. And climate control. Here's the radio view. Let's go ahead and show you a quick view of the climate control. You can control independently from the driver or passenger side. Very nice. And here starting with the left side we have the door lock, unlock, has the light control in red, and all the way to the right is the eco start and stop button. Simply press this down to turn the auto start and stop function on or off. And back to the left side we have a small knob to use to control the audio volume. Simply twist it over to the right or left to change the volume. And to turn the audio on and off simply press down on it. Here we have the dual AC heat climate control. Two cup holders. Here's a closer look at the gear shift box. To control this, you have to push your foot down the brake, twist it over to the OR to put the car into reverse. And when you do so, the rear view camera automatically displays on the GPS screen with guided lines that move according to the turning of the steering wheel. Very nice safety feature. Continue twisting it over to the right, N for neutral, D for drive, and as you notice right here, when you get to D, you'll not be able to twist it over to the S. You have to push down, then twist it over to the S. The S is for sports mode, and after you put it into the sport mode, you can actually use the standard gear shift paddle behind the steering wheel to change gears, and the gear will display on the odometer. Simply twist it all the way back to P to put the car into park. We have the traction control, winter driving mode. Here's the parking brake. To activate, simply lift it up. There will also be a notification icon on the odometer to tell you that the parking brake is on. And to deactivate the parking brake, simply push your foot down the brake and press down. Here we have a small slot for you to put change or anything you need. middle armrest compartment inside we have a auxiliary input USB input along with a 12 volt core torture and to open the glove box compartment simply touch the silver button here here it is I like the fact that the button you don't have to physically press it it is touch sensitive and as you can see, all you have to do is touch it to open. Full view of the dash. Wood trim look very nice on there. Rear view mirror with built in universal garage door opener. You can simply input your garage door codes in here and use those three buttons to open and close your garage doors. Light control on top, which is touch sensitive. You can simply touch it to turn it on or off.
parking assist. And here's the panoramic roof control button. As you can see, it extends all the way back to the rear. There's a tilt function. And when you open it fully, only the front portions open. Now let's take a closer look at what we have on the driver's side door. More wood trim. We have up to three memory settings for easy readjustment of the driver's seat. Door lock and unlock button. Four power window control. And at the bottom we have the window lock button. On top is the side view mirror control. And to fold and unfold the side view mirror, simply press both buttons. Side door storage. Jack or door seal. Brake and gas pedal. And here's the hood release lever again. 14 way power adjustable front driver's seat with four way lumbar support. Complete view of the seat. Again, the seat is ventilated, which can be controlled with heat. Seat belt is very smooth and nice. You can also adjust it by moving it up or down. Here's a close look at the back seat. More wood trim here also. Door lock and unlock button. Window control. And an ashtray. Side door storage. Jaguar door seal. Again, I'm five foot seven, so this gives you a better idea of how much leg space you will have. I feel pretty comfortable back here. Quick view the front from sitting in the back. Two additional air vents. And way below, we have two additional 12 volt core torture, along with the heating and cooling control function for the rear seats. And as you can see, the middle portion is split up here. And here we have additional storage compartment. Two additional cup holders. Here's a closer look at the back seat. Again, it is ventilated and can be controlled with heat and cool air. Rear seat belts also very smooth and quiet. Hand bow on top with a spot for you to hang your clothes. Light control above. And the light control back here are not touch sensitive. You have to press the button manually to turn it on or off. And in the middle, we have the rear roof control. As you can see, we can control the panoramic roof from sitting in the back which is a very nice feature because we don't see this feature much in any other models or make. Alright guys, that's all for today. Thanks everyone for watching. And as always, make sure to leave me comments and feedback as to what you think about this car below. For more future car reviews, go ahead and subscribe to this channel and remember to give our videos a thumbs up. Also, make sure to check out our official website and Facebook page for our everyday activity. Again, thanks everyone for watching and I'll see everyone in the next video review. Still here? Go ahead and click on one of the car on screen and continue watching. With 550 horsepower. Of course, as you move up the scale, the price tag will also increase. Here's the key fob to the car. On there, we have the lock, unlock, trunk release, panic button in red, and the light control button. Let's go ahead and unlock it and take a closer look at the interior. 
Now, as I just mentioned earlier, the XJ does come pre-equipped with a smart keyless access entry. So all you really have to do is leave the key fob in your pocket or purse. To unlock the door, simply put your hand behind the handle. And as you unlock the door, the side view mirror will automatically unfold. And to lock, simply touch a button on the outer side. Here's a quick view of the interior. Interior come in jet leather and burrow walnut wood trim. Looks very nice. Quick view of the back seat. And to start the engine, all I have to do is push your foot down on the brake and press the start button right here. With sophisticated and luxurious interior together with a dynamic driving experience, introducing the all new 2015 Jaguar XJ in Ultimate Black. The XJ is a sporting luxury sedan that comes with a 3.0 liter V6 supercharged engine that pushes out 340 horsepower. In addition, the XJ body is made extensively of lightweight aluminum. This together with the V6 engine enables the XJ to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 5.7 seconds. So unlike many other brands and models, the Jaguar XJ comes standard with many cool technologies. Some examples are the Smart Keyless Access Entry, Blind Spot Monitoring System, Soft Closing Door, Panoramic Glass Roof, Power Trunk, and the 8-inch Color Touchscreen Display with Navigation System. Now the model we're looking at here is the basic XJ model that comes as a rear-wheel drive. Of course, you can upgrade it to the all-wheel drive model or the XJ Supercharged version with 470 horsepower or the most powerful XJ or model. Now to open the engine hood, there's going to be a lever down here. All we have to do is pull this lever out. This will initially open the hood. And to open the hood fully, there's going to be another lever located right on top of the Jaguar logo. All we have to do is lift that up and raise the hood. Under the hood, the 2015 Jaguar XJ has a 3.0 liter V6 supercharged engine. The V6 engine is able to push out 340 horsepower and 332 pound-foot of torque. It is a 8-speed automatic transmission with shift paddles mounted behind the steering wheel. The 2015 Jaguar XJ can get from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just under 5.7 seconds, and its top speed is electronically limited to 121 miles per hour. Keep in mind this is a rear-wheel drive vehicle. As for fuel economy, the XJ gets 18 miles per gallon in the city. 27 miles per gallon on the highway and when combined it gets 21 miles per gallon. The gas mileage will vary depending on which driving mode you're in, relax, sport, or winter. To further enhance gas mileage, you can also enable the intelligent stop and start feature which will automatically shut off the engine when you come to a complete stop such as red lights or traffic jams and it will instantly restart as soon as you lift your foot off the brake. What's good about this feature is that you can turn it on or off at any time you like. Up front, there's the power intermittent windshield wiper. To the back, there's the middle LED brake light located behind the rear windshield. Moving down, there's the Jaguar logo in the middle and on both sides are the eye-catching LED tail lamps with LED brake light and LED turn signal light. The rear is also equipped with a rear view camera that automatically turns on when the car is put into reverse. Parking assists are also built into the rear bumper that automatically notifies the driver when the vehicle gets close to hitting any objects. At the bottom, there's the gorgeously attractive rear diffuser that hugs the dual chrome exhaust tip. And lastly, to specifically distinguish this from other models, there's the XJ badge located on the left hand side. As for the gas tank, just make sure the car is unlocked. To open, simply push in. And to lock, simply push back. Here's a full view of the roof. 
And I also show you what the panoramic roof look like with the tilt function on and what it look like fully open. Here it is with the tilt function on. As you can see it slightly raises up which looks very cool and sporty. Moving down we have the chrome mesh grille with the iconic Jaguar badge in the center. The front bumper is equipped with parking sensors that will automatically notify the driver when the vehicle gets close to hitting any objects. For enhanced visibility there's the intelligent front lighting system that consists of the stylish bifunction HID Xenon headlights with power washer feature along with the integral LED signature daytime running lights. You can also add the optional adaptive front lighting system. With this the headlight will follow the driver's steering wheel input and shine the beam in the direction of the wheels. There's also the intelligent high beam that will automatically switch to low beam as cars approach and will switch back to high beam after they pass. Moving over to the side, there's the Jaguar side fender. Body color side view mirror with integrated LED turn signal light, power adjustable feature, and power folding feature. And lastly, there's also the built in blind spot monitoring system on both side view mirror that uses radar technology to alert your driver if there's a car in the blind spot while changing lanes. The standard XJ model comes with 19 inch 10 spokes Aleutian alloy wheels. Behind the wheels, we have the advanced Jaguar braking system that includes emergency brake assist, electronic brake force distribution dynamic stability control, and cornering brake control. All four wheels are equipped with the tire pressure monitoring system.